here so before we get into the video I want to make sure you guys have your notifications on so here is the notification list you want to make sure you click all so that you're notified whenever I post a new video because you know YouTube is constantly changing its rules so yeah I just want to make sure you guys are notified so make sure you check your notification bell but we're gonna go ahead and jump right into the video in today's video is a pretty cool video it's a hair video and I'm gonna show you guys how I revamp my puff and how I deal with gel flaking because I do get questions quite often you guys leave in the comments and you guys tell me that your gel always flakes that's why you don't like to use gel for your puffs now I'm gonna be completely transparent in this video and I'm gonna show you guys my hair is currently flaked up now I've been wearing my puff for about three days and usually after the third day my hair starts to flake so this is what my hair is looking like so of course it's going to be time for me to wash my hair pretty soon here but i'm not quite ready to wash my hair just yet so i want to wear my puff maybe for a few more days so i'm going to show you guys how i do with flaking how to get rid of it how you work with it because i don't care what gel you use you're going to endure some flaking period that's just how it is so uh, here's my band i get a lot of questions about my band i will link some videos in the description box for you guys showing you guys how i make my band um but yeah so it'd be linked below but yeah basically i just cut it and tie it and if you want a more in-depth video on it like i said it will be linked below so you guys see my hair is pretty flaked up here like really flaked up so what i'm gonna go ahead and do is i'm going to take some water now you want to use like warm water it doesn't really matter but i like to use warm water and what the water is going to do is going to activate the gel which meaning is going to make the gel get back kind of like a gel like instead of being dry and flaky if you know what i mean because you already have product in your on your hair and what you don't want to do is add more product on top of the flaking you don't want to do that so i'm just going to take my spray bottle of water and i'm literally just going to spray and like smooth up like this so I'm just gonna spray it spray where it's flaking but actually I'm gonna just spray it all around my hair since we're gonna be wearing our puff again and this is a ponytail puff actually I do have a tutorial on it it is an older one it will be linked in the description box below but if you guys want me to update it I definitely will so just comment and let me know so as you guys can see by me just doing this the flaking is going away and now my hair my hand is really slippery because now the gel is back activated as you guys can see now you can see the gel but it's back activated so it's not flaky or anything so i'm just gonna do it around the back i'm sure i probably have some flaking around the back as well so that's what I'm going to do and guys I do this even when I wear buns and I have gel in my hair so basically you're just gonna refresh it gel is back activated okay you probably can see it on my hand and it's back activated it's nice and gel like you can take a towel of some sort and just wipe your hand off um so next what you want to do is take your brush I know everybody uses different brushes, but this is the one I use. Um, I've had this brush for years. So then I'm just going to brush my hair up. Now you still will see that it's white. Like you're still going to see some white, not flakes, but you're just going to see it being white from us activating that gel. And if you watch the tutorial, you'll know what I mean by ponytail puff because it is two different things in my opinion. Now that you've gotten your hair all smoothed back up, you want to take your band. And if my forehead is looking funny, it's because I have makeup on. And it's blending in with the water. Okay, so you want to just, you know, put your puff, ponytail puff, back into place. Like so. Okay, so you may have some shrinkage like I do because it has been about three days. So there we have that. I'm not going to add any more gel because we already activated the old gel. But to my hairline, I am going to add some gel because I want to lay down my hair. And this is not enough hold because what happens is when you put the water in, on top of the gel, it kind of dilutes it a little bit. So my edges aren't going to like stay in place. 
So I am going to go back in with some gel. And I'm just using this one from Eco Sour. It's the black um, cast oil and flaxseed. So I'm just going to lay down my edges with a teeny bit amount of gel. Not too much. This is definitely optional. I'm just going to take this um, scarf. And I get a lot of questions on where I got this. I've had this one for a while too. As you guys can see, this one has a hole in it actually. I got them from Family Dollars. I don't know if they still carry them. I haven't checked. I have to check for you guys, but that's where I got them from. So I'm just going to tie my hair back down so we can kind of get that water to stay in place because we did apply water on top of the gel and you know sometimes water can make your hair get a little frizzy. And then in the meantime, I'm just going to kind of like pick my puff and get it back to my ponytail puff, get it back to how I want it to look. Okay. You can proceed to do your makeup or whatever the case may be and then I'll be back in about 15 minutes. Okay y'all, so I'm back. So I'm just going to take off my scarf and everything should be laid, honey. It might still be a little bit wet, like the back of my hair is a little bit wet. But then you just want to pick it, pick your puff and pull it forward. And don't mind the lines on my forehead. It's just because um I had the scarf on. <laughs> Once you do this, your hair may be a little dull because you know you have gel on your hair and sometimes gel can make your hair dull. So I just like to use this pink sheen spray. This is oil sheen basically. I'm sure you guys all know what oil sheen is. And I'm just gonna spray some on my hair to bring the luster back, you know? But this is basically how I refresh my ponytail puff. And as you guys can see, there is no flaking. No flaking. So my method actually works, guys. So if you were wondering how to take care of flaking, and when you tie your hair up at night, for the next three days, you shouldn't get any flaking, see much flaking, because basically now the gel is diluted with the water. So yes, and then you can just go and proceed to wear your ponytail puff for a few more days, or your puff for a few more days, and then go ahead and wash your hair, because I will be washing my hair in a few days. But I just wanted to make my hair stretch a little longer. And that's how you do so when you endure flaking. <laughs> so I hope you all enjoyed this video. I hope these tips were really helpful for you guys. Thanks for watching and I will see you all in my next one. Bye. <laughs>